Hey guys, if you're getting a fatal JavaScript error occurred when trying to open Discord, then keep watching as in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to solve this. So the first thing you need to do is just make sure you've closed out of the Discord application. Then we're gonna come over to the start menu and just search for task manager. And from the search box at the top, just type in the word Discord and make sure you've completely closed out of the application. If you do see Discord somewhere in this list, then you can just right click on it and select end task. Now, once you've completely closed out of Discord, Discord, we can then head out of the task manager window. Then we're going to come over to the start menu and just search for settings. Click on apps from the left hand side and select installed apps. Using the search box at the top, just type in the word Discord. And if you do see Discord in this list, click on the three horizontal dots and select uninstall and then press uninstall to confirm. So once you've uninstalled Discord, we're then going to head over to our start menu, search for CMD and then right click on the command prompt and run this as administrator. In this window, you need to type in GP update space forward slash force and hit enter and then wait until this is finished updating the policy and then you can close out of this window once you've done that head over to your start menu search for run and click on the run icon in this search box type in percentage sign app data percentage sign and hit enter then you need to scroll down and look for the discord folder once you've found discord we're going to right click on it and select the trash icon to delete it once you've deleted discord from here close out of this folder come back over to the start menu and search for run click on the run icon and this time type in percentage sign local app data percentage sign and hit enter and once again scroll down until you see the discord folder and we're going to right click on it and select the trash icon to delete it now once you've deleted both of these folders you'll then need to head over to an internet browser head over to the discord website and we're just going to re-download discord to our computer once discord's finished downloading you can open up the setup file and now you'll be able to reinstall this to your computer and it should work without any issues if you did find this video helpful then let me know in the comments and i'll see you in the next one